The city purchased this property on College Avenue in Old Louisville. It used to house the Archdiocese of Louisville Chancery, but soon up to 50 unsheltered individuals will be able to set up their tents and get access to crucial services. Over the summer, the city once again began clearing out homeless encampments after the COVID-19 shelter-in-place order was lifted, renewing the need to look at more long-term solutions for those living on the streets. We must address the immediate challenge of providing a safer, healthier space for hoax, folks who, for whatever reason, will not utilize an indoor shelter. Last month, Mayor Greg Fisher announced a multi-pronged approach to address that challenge. The first step is creating a safe place where people can live and get access to on-site services that will address the root cause of what's keeping them unsheltered. There's no one-size-fits-all for our houseless community. We have so many subpopulations that are out on the street. We have mental health. We have substance abuse. We have medically fragile. We have re-entry. We have domestic violence. The Office of Resilience and Community Services hopes the site will help them establish connections and help people get on a path to more permanent, affordable housing. This is a first temporary step. No one believes it is the last one or that it is the permanent solution to what we are seeing on our streets. The pilot program was modeled after safe outdoor spaces like this one in Denver, which opened late last year. Since opening in December 2020, the safe outdoor space in Denver had made over 180 case management appointments. The city also plans to make $1.4 million in upgrades to some of the existing buildings that will allow them to provide indoor showers, cooking facilities, and restrooms. They hope to have it up and running sometime in November. Reporting in Old Louisville, Drew Gardner, WLKY News.